Welcome back to another episode of Cyberpunk 2077. So in the last episode, uh, what have I done? In the last episode, um, yeah, Panam. We went with Panam and we bought uh, the man. What was his name? Hellman. Yeah, we got Hellman. Now he will be uh you know interviewed or you know something okay while we are catching her man uh i think panam you know friends okay michael or mike or oh, oh, i mean there is one guy was i mean one guy died while doing that mission while we are capturing her man and yeah good news is we got his bike because he is no more so we'll use his bike that's a good news and yeah now we got hellman takemura will do his investigation or whatever we call that's it let's go and check out hellman who said you crazy we gotta talk who are you working for you're a noble asaka do you wish to take me back pathetic rats got no let's skip ahead not you haven't found a f sorry guys i'm just kicking don't take this personally i'm skipping again because i have played this i don't know why all takamura just just remember you have helmet and that's one hell of a card try to win some Takamura, good news. Got Hellman. Alive. What did he say? Alive, alive. Not too talkative now. Taking him to the Sunset Motel. I will come to you. Keep him there until I arrive. You got it. See ya. Okay, all this is done. Now Panam with his people will Better be outside. Somewhere you can talk in peace. True. Is. Looks like your new chimbas are here. Okay. Is that him? Sure is. Take him outside. Toss him on the bike. Stay right there. The cavalry has arrived. Mitch gathered together a few elder cavalry. <clears throat> the road was clear. I don't think we were. Sp okay, let's skip ahead. Just gotta. Saul. Every. So now uh, we use this bike. This is our bike. Okay, so this is where we stopped in the last episode. Hey. Where am I? What is this place? I want to talk about your little invention. Biochip you made for Arisaka. Fine. But let's get one thing straight first. Yorinobu Arisaka didn't send you? No. This means you must have an offer for me. If your boss will pay more than Kang Tao, I believe we can talk. 
You misunderstand me. There is no offer. What do you want? Your text trying to kill me. Pretty sure that's not how it's advertised. If you wish to file a complaint, I'll need more details. Got Johnny Silverhand's construct stuck in my head. And I don't want it there. Silverhand? Construct? That's impossible. Where did you get this biochip? Clepped it off Yorinobu Arasaka. Job for a client. But the client left me out And of you decided the best place for it was in your own goddamn head. Actually, wasn't a bad idea. Construct rebooted me when my own goddamn head took a bullet. I always knew Yorinobu's plan would fail. I just never imagined it would turn out like this. Arisaka's prized tech really is in the very streets of the city. You have to remove the biochip from my system. It's not that simple. Look, you made the thing, didn't you? So where's the problem? If you're telling the truth, you slotted in a new experimental version of the biochip. How's the prototype version different? It's got a different engram, something more... Aware? Aggressive? The biochip is what's unique, not Silverhand's engram. The previous version of the chip was only used to communicate with pre-saved engrams. And it was rare as fuck and cost a fortune. Yeah. This one's rarer. Meant to install and activate the engram in a new body. When I left Arisaka, the project was still in the trial phase. Huh. Imagine my luck to be so fucking unique, so fucking exceptional. That mean you'll help me? Well, well. I would have to see it first. Okay. Hmm. Unbelievable. It looks like... Can't believe this Seuss the one who's gonna help us. Oh, fuck. Impressive, isn't it? What a pity I won't be able to examine it for yeah, you. Yeah, real shame. You could have been his guinea pig, too. Tell me how to get rid of it. I'm afraid I have bad news. Your neural network has completely deteriorated. It can no longer function independently of the chip. Okay. The only thing I could do... Woohoo, it's bargaining time. ...is to give you information on a good clinic in Sweden. They'll help you through the terminal stages. Minimize the pain. What exactly is going on in my head? You tell me. What's it like to have two personalities? Because it's not like you're hearing voices. You are both yourself and Silverhand, simultaneously. I can see him and talk to him. You're not talking, but yes, I understand what you mean. Have you noticed the Construct's influence on your decision-making? Jeez, give it a rest. What do you mean? You will start doing things that were once unthinkable, at least to your old self. And you know exactly who he was. A fanatic. A terrorist. A suicide bomb. Oh, fuck me. Who's trying to mess with your head now? That is why I believe it would be better for you to... At least Johnny never whored himself out like you. Are you defending him? Or is that Johnny speaking now? Oh, let me guess. He already tried to take over your body. You know, just for a little while. No. Would you, though? Could be fun. Johnny. Kidding. But watch out. Suit's getting ready to talk your head off. Know what? That's enough. You just playing for time? Because I can't tell. Are you trying to convince me you're useless? Because, I mean, in that case, I can just shoot you in the head and save us both some time. Ah, oh, finally. I will try to help you. If you come with me to Kang Tao. Forget Kang Tao. Got any other ideas? If you think there's anyone else who can help you, I could give you the blueprints. Complete project documentation. Kang Tao offered quite the sum for it. You got it with you? He's got to. Gong's fucking useless without him. Me? Hey. Takamura? What the hell is he doing here? He's got a few questions of his own for you. You play nice, he might even save your ass. I'm almost done. 
The blueprints. Better than nothing. Long as we find someone fluent in techno babble. <laughs> He's all yours. I'll give you two some space. I hope we can come to an understanding. That is certainly in your best interest. V, I will remember this. Ah, this heat. My throat is positively parched. Mm. We did not give you even a glass of water. Unacceptable. Inhumane. See that? Fuck me. Just look I'm at that. Buckets. No. What the oh. hell is happening? Sons of bitches. If you gotta say, say it. Got something eating at your code, that's clear. Been trying to learn how you're wired this whole time. To know who I'm dealing with. Thought you were just unlucky at first, but I kept watching and finally realized what your problem is. You were a kid from the Badlands. Family was your crutch and c But in NC, you're nobody. Best you can do is steal from scavs. The Merc Janitors. Let's cut this juvenile bullshit. I'm just trying to help you. Well, I neither want, nor do I need, your help. Just go. Had enough of you. What are the other leads? Okay, what does that mean? Play it safe. Pursue other leads while waiting for Takumura to get ready. What's that mean? in all the Badlands.
Okay, so do I have to go and do some other missions? Diamond cap. I don't think that was that much important. Okay, so yeah, I don't know how long Takamura will take to investigate that guy. Let's see what's good. Take your pick. Thank you. 
Pokemon, where is my free reward? I can take anything. Hey, then I can take anything. Oh man, I had a doubt what, what to buy and what. Yeah, this could be better, right? My God, what was my free item actually? Select your free world rider, repeat shop inventory. How's biz treating you, Cassius? Lately, can't complain. MaxTac raided a black clinic not long past. Since then, custom accounts gone up and so my prices. Coincidence? I'm gonna take that then. So it's not there. Hmm, armor by 50%, let's get this. Just buy this now. Oh my god, where is the free reward? Oh man, I have to go and check each and everything out. Huh? I don't understand where to get this feed. Just wide. Something. Okay, let's go and check what each and everything whether it's free or not. Nothing came free there. I'm searching everything and I don't find any cheaper one.
I was at a correct shop, right? We are dog riders. The dog shop inventory. I have gone through each and every item of the inventory, but nothing was free. Oh my god. Done here. Let's go and check out this mission. Uh, we need to talk with Johnny. With this. I, I like to drive now. Okay, so let's check this out. Pathetic. You can barely hold the thing. Ladies and gentlemen, a critic. Chill, Chumba. Ain't half bad. Guy's hurt. Got something he can't take. And it shows. I remember when I came last time I was talking about this guitar and I left two other missions and I thought that was just a street busker with big dreams don't make me laugh no time for playing my way to the top was too busy shaking the world awake being at the top can be worth it you want to shake the world you know <laughs> Well, the world's got to feel you first. And you pay for it. You spend your lyrics laying waste to the big record corpse. Who's going to sign you then? But give up your ideals, and no amount of eddies can buy them back. 
All right, princess. At least you play some gigs. It's all those memories of yours. True. Played where we could. Parks, old factories, underground clubs. Had an audience from the start. Some recorded our stuff, didn't even know who we were. So, you're saying some old samurai bootlegs are still floating around town. Ooh, I smell heads. No idea you were such a materialist. Could almost cry. Almost. But jokes aside, you think those tapes still exist? After all these years? Hmm, you know, Rainbow Cadenza is not far from here. Club we played till the band fell apart. Great spot. Place for people with their heads on straight. Maybe they'll know something. Hmm. Let's go and get out that club. Um, Johnny? Pretty sure they turned your great spot into a slurp shop. Mindless fucking consumerism wins the day again. Point for the other team, huh? Huh. This is why you don't bring back fallen warriors. Sooner or later, they're gonna see everything they fought for is turned to shit. Know anything about any bootlegs from the Rainbow Cadenza days? Like, say, I don't know, uh, samurai stuff? Samurai. Samurai. Oh, that ugly red face on black? Yeah, even I know that one. Old guy comes by here sometimes, wearing their shirt. Spends the whole time yakking with his psycho fan friends. Wouldn't happen to know where I could find him. You can find him living back in the 2020s. <laughs> But besides that, he's out there at the market. What's he selling? Canic strawberries and cream. What do you think? He sells ancient dusty tapes of ancient dusty indie bands. No one's heard of a single one of them. Green, thanks. Hey, hey, he was I heard I can get some decent tunes here. What you mean by decent? We got Cartesian duelists. Any samurai? <laughs> Kid, you even gotta ask? Never fade away. Dancing with my axe, chipping in, you name it, we got it. Silverhand was the one true messiah of rock. I'd hand them records out like candy if I could. But a guy's gotta eat. I see I found Silverhand's biggest fan. And proud of it. Today's bitty box rockers can't even touch him. Silverhand had something they couldn't even dream of. Uh, a Silverhand? He had that <laughs> fire, kid. Fire! Guy shook the foundations of the corporal world. He died for his idea. Doesn't matter, he was also kind of a terrorist. Blake. I'm looking for the real deal. Like, say bootlegs from Samurai's first gigs. Fuck. First, you have got no idea what you're asking for. Not if you're so, so chilled about it. Don't know how you found out about them bootlegs, but forget it. Not gonna give them to the first gunk off the street. I used to, uh, come here back when it was still Rainbow Cadenza. Bootleg sure would make a nice souvenir of the good old days. Cut the scop. You're too young to remember the first samurai gigs. Weren't even a twinkle in your daddy's kuroshis. Hey, appearances can be deceiving. How do you know this pretty face ain't an implant? All right, punk. Prove it. How'd samurai's third ever gig end? Johnny, my dear expert, help with you now. I need a quick rundown of samurai trivia. Yep, third gig. Remember it like it was yesterday. Set my axe on fire, then smashed it on the stage. Crowd went wild. Well, can't wait all day. Easy. Johnny lit up his axe, then smashed it. Nope. Knew it. Who smashes their gear when they're just starting out? I mean, a new one costs eddies. 
Johnny, please, can you stop making my life harder? My life that's quickly running out? How am I supposed to give a witty response to that pathetic question? It's like kicking a puppy, a blind puppy. You always freeze up like this? Played our third gig at Cadenza. Little fire broke out. Some drunk gonks tried to put it out with beer. Denny's fro got singed, wore a wig for a few weeks. Never did get herself any tech hair. Hang on, hang on. Now I remember. There was a fire. Oh, poor Denny. Poor Denny's hair. <laughs> I almost forgot. Heard Johnny started it, actually. Tossed a cig that was still glowing. <laughs> Bullshit. That cig was Carrie's, no doubt. But hey, any trouble's Johnny's fault. Still don't believe you were there. But what the hell? Only a real fan could know something like that. Hey, anyways, gotta educate the youth. Maybe you'll find something special under the table. Come on, have at it. Okay, so this was the CD, right? Fired. Done? Yeah. Much appreciated. Take it. Spread the good silver hand. Get the coins. You know, they say time is the best teacher. Used to think that was true. But look at that guy. 60 at least, but still living in 2020. Guy's your biggest fan. You're not happy to meet him? Busaka Tower to smithereens, and it's still standing there, just the same. Don't want people getting stuck in a rut, stuck in the past. Want them to change, them and the world. It's been 60 years. Something must have changed. Know what changed? The damn facade. Fresh interface plugs, new high fructose scop syrup, and fun fruity flavors. A new face of Arasaka, same old shit, different packaging. Something's changed. Maybe we can't see it, but it's changed all the same. Sure, now almost nobody remembers when a person wasn't just a meat bag full of secondhand implants. Okay. Call Mr. Hans. Yeah. Hey, what's shaking? Need to make contact with the Voodoo Boy's chief if you can swing it. All right, all right. Straight to heavy business. Hmm. Now, that'd be Maman Brigitte. Be tough getting a word into her. You really don't do any biz with them? Not with the chefs, chefins, priests, and whatnot. All got dirigible-sized egos. Won't talk to lowly me. But if you insist, I can ask around, try to set something up. I'll just need some details first. Uh, got something they want. Truly? Want to sell something to the BDBs? Trust me, they don't want it, they don't need it. They're isolated, insulated. They got their own contracts, tech, networks. But have it your way. Okay, I'll see what I can do and get back to you. Okay. Oh man, now what? Now what? I need him to call me, right? And when that's gonna happen? Okay, that's a side job. We establish connections. Side job. Side job. Side job. Side job. Side job. Side job. And that too, they are danger. The element. Side job. The element.
Oh man, what now? this video here and we'll wait if we have any new missions I mean any call from Takamura or this Mr. Hands so until then I'll just roam guys so yeah thanks for joining this and hope you all enjoyed this see you all in the next video we got some contact hello we haven't met I'm Elizabeth my husband and I we need a somewhat delicate matter handled we think you could help. Why call me of all people? Any particular reason? You came recommended. Yeah, who by? I'd rather not say. Not over the phone. Is there any way we could meet? Discuss some details? Sure, let's do that. I'll send you the address. See you. You don't know me, but you will. How oh, many of this? Downtown city center. V. Yeah, I know. What about you? Odd stuff. Need anything you call me. Remember, Dino knows everybody. Okay, let's check out Panam. Akemura call. The raid will soon start. I will wait where we met before. By the stalls. Just stay out of trouble, okay? Okay, so in the next episode, we gonna have this mission. Okay, where we will meet Hanaka Sama. Yeah. So, yeah, I'll check you all there. See you all in the next episode. And thanks for joining us. Maybe this was a mission, right? Go to Bazaar in Japan town. Yes, that was that. Okay. Okay then, yeah. Until then, keep watching and bye-bye.